was a dream that was real. It shall be realized. These are the wishes of Marcus Aurelius. Okay. So we're still at war with three factions, which we don't want any of their land, which is an issue. Because I don't really want to fight them. And just like staying there, hoping they're going to attack to wipe their armies is um, a bit of a waste of time. Everyone's time, mine and yours. So, well, we'll see what happens. Right, I did have a couple of problems with the bot, well, the AI. They're doing some stupid shit. Alright, we need to gather the staff up. So we need to get over there and somehow talk to them. They may be here, I'm not sure why, it, why it's tagged. Yeah, I assume we need to talk to this guy. I never did the, did the mission, though. See what, how it goes. Now. I'm thinking of actually like creating another party since I got the guy right here. Although that wouldn't be the smartest of ideas since we're at war. Well, let's do it anyway. You see your ship scouting? Yeah, this this guy. Hail to the king, baby. Oh god damn it, Sammy, is that you again? You're too generous, man. You're too generous. Got to repay you somehow, some way. I kinda don't wanna give up my archers and my infantry. <laughs> Busted. <laughs> well, you're the only one so far, right? Maybe you should donate by crypto. Then I wouldn't know if it's you. Um, let's give him a bunch of these. Well, I could give him a good mix, though. Oh, thanks, man. Happy you enjoyed them. By the way, there's a... A good deal on Humble Choice this time around. It's uh, 10 euros or 12 dollars. You get uh, Borderlands 3 and Borderlands 3 Director's Cut DLC or ex expansion pack, whatever the fuck it is. I mean, if you like Borderlands, that is. I do. Let's drink some... Yeah, Hell Energy drink. Some knockoff. Or apparently one of the... One of, some musician or actor is sponsoring this one or making this one. Not quite sure which one, though. We don't want to give him the... Let's actually give him all the crossbowmen, since I can live without them. And... Uh, let's give him some more infantry. He should be able to like pick up a lot of troops easily enough. Sammy, do you want me to give you a list of... Uh, I got over a hundred games on the Humble, not unclaimed. You can pick whichever you want. There's a lot of AAA games on there too. Sure, I just don't have the time to get you know get to these days. Yeah, yeah, I think four troops is enough for him. I think.
I don't think so. So parties with only one like uh, guy in them, right? Mm, no, I, I don't think so. I am on version 1.7.0. Maybe they fixed that at this point. I mean, hopefully. I don't. I don't think I have the bug. But the game is still in early access, man. Right? <laughs> you can't complain because it's in early access. <laughs> Let's get, get him to do that. Uh, then we uh, sign for you. Avoid enemies. Don't chase. Oh. <laughs> uh, I do love how like nothing would just uh, wounds the people, wounds the soldiers like. Why don't they just disband, like run away, like they used to in Warband? That would make more sense. Oh, he's not feeding him, feeding me. Fuck him, you know. I'm gonna leave. Uh, what's the mod that you said that uh, makes it so the AI plays by the player rules again? You know where they have to go around recruiting stuff like normal. Wait, what? No. I mean, hopefully this guy is gonna be able to, like, save that. I did tell him to, like, not engage enemy parties, but they should actually, you know, try and save my villages at least. Yeah, do. Yeah, do. I have a shitload of food. Let's go. I think these villages around here usually have the Optios, which are gonna give us... Oh fuck, I hit the wrong button. Fill stacks, okay, I need to... Save that somewhere. Try that out. I wanna see how the AI fares when they're playing the game like we are. Even the playing field a little bit. Save that. You don't recruit that guy. Mm. Can we get out of any wars today, though? Not really. We can go to a war. That's nice. Or start a war that is oh, ho, 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 ho. the mother load should be over 300 never runs out of food i think they have a skill that like something with food on the last one uh what was it right stewardship yeah this one your party food consumption wages and combat morale lose Loss decreases by 0 0.5 per skill above 200. So I think that, that like, you know, if he has 400 skill, I mean, it's going to negate it completely, more or less, maybe. Like, almost completely. Maybe that maybe it's because of that. I mean, the mod does make it so you can create some stupidly overpowered... Uh... Companions, but then again, if you look at the lords, enemy lords, wait a minute, uh, facts. Yeah, look at the clan, like she, for example. Okay, maybe she's not the, maybe she's not the best. Uh, what's one to pick for? 
clan or an empire. Yeah, let's see the, the king. Yeah, look at his stats. Isn't he a little bit overpowered, you know? Like most of these. I mean, they're good with bows, they're good with two handed weapons, they're good with trade, charm, stewardship, leader, leadership, tactics, throwing, well, all the, all the shit. Well, I still have the new version of the mod on. Then again, I like, I mean, at this point, I created all the parties I can, so I'm not gonna make more. Um, Companions out with. You know, it's only overpowered if you choose to make it because you can skip all the, you know, the primary, tertiary, and secondary skills. You don't need to actually, like, take them. So it's down to the player, more or less. Right. So one of our guys is engaging on another guy. the third one okay he's there the vassal oh yeah vassals making them vassals is a good idea too because like persuading everyone doing the fucking speech check whatever the fuck it is is kind of annoying one of those things that I never got like uh, if you ever looked at the that thing in uh, what's the, what's the game called in yeah, my brain ain't working um, oblivion Elder scrolls I never got to how the uh, speed checks with like persuading people worked I have no freaking clue Let's grab a bit more butter. Sell this off. And uh, did you... Since you're here, how does the faction thing exactly work? Like, I made a faction to, like, uh, get the king off the throne. How do... How, oh. Ooh. I guess this clan is on our side, right? How do you actually get people on your side? Because I talked to like clan leaders and all that, but in, like there's no option to like persuade them or anything to join your faction. All right, I need to look at the, the policies too. Uh, all right. I mean, there, you can actually like create a faction to succeed for the empire from the empire. But uh, I think if you like, you know, start you you have to start a war. Yeah, look at that, start a rebellion to actually get it to work. Which is, I mean, it's much easier to just leave the kingdom and take your land with you, right? Clan four, right? Yeah, we're clan tier four. I need to like write down which one of these I actually like. I don't need to like go through these and look at all every time. I guess we'll find out how the factions work, right? Soon enough.
Tax from fortifications. What? Well, the, pro the problem with that is, uh, I don't have the culture change mod on because it used it, like every time I load it back into the game, it would change the culture of the towns to. You know, the Imperial, the vanilla Imperial's culture. So, uh, it's gonna be a, you know, a problem holding on to the towns without them rebelling over there. I can, I think you can add that mod on whenever. So I meant like look into it, see if they can make it working. Make it work. Eww. They ain't never gonna Oh ooh. Ooh, he fucked up. He fucked up. Yep. Oh, oh, oh. Look at how many optias we got, Jesus Christ. Now this ain't fair. Wait a minute. The party capacity didn't go up. What the fuck game? Look at the amount of influence I have, James. <laughs> Jesus. Right, now since I have a clan member. A lot of a salary, they do five kill SMU, make some some command, then let them rule. Oh, well, I guess that makes sense. But, but does the culture ever change? No, wait a minute. Uh, yeah, she already, no, never mind. Does she hold land? Mm. No, she does not, right? Oh, my wife is her enemy. <laughs> the problem, culture doesn't change. Like, why? It was a thing in Warband. Why not here? Okay, so can I... She doesn't hold land, so can I talk to her and give her something? Even though I don't really want to, but still. Okay, let's see. Yo, oh, she's fucking broke, that's for sure. Um, there's fuck all we can do. Ooh, they're not Let me... F let me, uh do some combat before I do go into war because it's on the highest if am I fucking of course I'm gonna get the bill what else there's a spear give me the spear Never mind. Yeah, the Optios uh, make your... Uh, increase your party capacity. You know, uh, like before in the mod, they used to like have the plus something on them. Like plus damage reduction or some or plus morale. 
I don't know why, like, that's not in the game still. Like, where it actually tells you what they do. I ain't scared. Alright, maybe I should be scared because it's on the highest difficulty. Yeah, that didn't kill me. No way. <laughs> Yeah, you can see, like, you can see for the morale. You see the legionary Aquilifier, Pilus Prior, Centurion, Signifier, Optio. Yeah, all of them give party morale. Plus, you can see here on the troop capacity, like, Horde Leader gives you plus 10, Leader of the Mass, 25, Clan, Tear Bones, blah, blah, blah. 25 legionary, legionaries, Pilus Prior, give 45. Um, party capacity. Two legionary centurios give 20. 11 legionary optios give 15. So the more you pick uh, pick those, uh, more of them you pick up, uh, the more... Uh, I think these, yeah, these ones. The more party capacity are you gonna have. That's a really cool thing. Because you, you know how slow it is to like actually like get the troop count up takes for freaking ever okay what to do what to do i don't want to fight them especially them how many archers do we have look at the body capacity on these guys <laughs> Uh, six, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna go pick up some archers from our castles, right? Yeah, easy. I have no freaking clue who the fuck that is, but we're gonna free him. Archers, man. I'm gonna take half of them. Wait a minute. What was the party? Okay, with 60 archers. Yeah, 100 archers should be fine enough. Seven. Yeah, sure, we can deal with that. Okay, now. Now. No, not that. Hmm. Traveling over there. Let's see what these guys are go going to a point. Yeah, I also like going to a point, right? Oh, never mind, that army just formed. I know what I'm gonna do. Let's go up there and form an army with our, our uh, mother parties we have. That alone is gonna, gonna give me around 700 troops or something like that. Maybe I should get all of them to come. Join me as fast as possible. Banner paste? Uh, I assume you make can get custom um custom banner custom banners with that, right? 
Oh, big uh, big battle, boys. Yes. Oh, this ain't even fair. <laughs> Not fair at all. I don't have the banner paste mod. Is it for, like, yeah, I didn't grab it. I mean, the since I'm playing Rome, the, the, the standard ba banner is good enough for me. The look of it, at least. Oh, why don't I get to get to this map before? You have a cool flag for Romans. I usually like. Uh, I think you can find. Well, there's a uh, there's a playlist on my YouTube channel with the Prophecy of Realm one. I did that in uh, uh, Old Fire. I did that uh, like, um, you know, the fa fascists, the, you know, the bundle of sticks with an axe in the middle of them, picture into it. I made that my banner. I was playing Prophecy of Pandor. The mall of Prophecy of Pandor, though. We well, want to face me. Okay, let's actually help our friends a little bit. Just a little bit, not much. Maybe camp the hill here. The hell with you indeed. Uh, usually the, uh, the reason why I don't want to like um, add a lot of mods into the game because you know it can crash so like I can live without a banner base mod you know so let's leave our cab in the back we're gonna need them if we ever go to war on this on the city in front Oh the god, the FPS drops. You know, this is a really bad idea because <laughs> they're um, green too. The fact that they can actually recruit our own troops kind of makes it even worse. So you're like, oh, the, those are our guys. Never mind. No, they're not. Yeah, I can't tell who's... I have no clue who's who here. Fuck off, horse, please. The mercy mods? I don't really have to, like, sit down one day, like, to look through the next mods. In mod DB2. I didn't like to look at the mods for a long time. Might be something interesting. The, 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 uh, does the decapitation one still work? Dismemberment? What the, I think it's called dismember. Dismember. Dismemberment, right? I think that still works. <laughs> Look at that. A thousand Romans on the field. That fucking smile, man. When I told him my name, he was like, I don't like you no more. OK, 
can just pick up the horse and the food. Oh, the, the what? Why would the armor have to do anything with that? A lot kind of sucks. This guy is gonna reach us soon enough. Hmm. I kind of don't want to like expand this way. I do want to like maybe like take this little bit of the island. Well, not island. It's not an island. But you get what I mean. Since they have a lot of war exhaustion, but actually we have more. Attack the enemy lord prisoner, they say. He's not gonna escape immediately, they say. Meanwhile... Come on, get your, get your ass over here. Ooh, look at that. We're gonna, we're gonna have like... A thousand man. Well, yeah, almost a thousand man with uh, the three parties we have, four parties we have, alone. Do I have to wash my ass? Remember when I used to like fight six, seven battles before I actually besieged, took this, you know, started the siege battle in front of the siege, siege city? That those days were fun. And I was fighting the Azerai, Kuzai, like six times before I actually, you know, got to besiege the city. Those were the days. I think, I, yeah, this. That playthrough is still is up on YouTube. Two big handles? Hmm. Me. Oops. Gratics. Actually, they don't like to look at their armies that much. Yeah, they mean these ones or like noble ones? I'm gonna assume the noble ones, probably. The fuck is this? Spear? A, a pike? Wait, wait, why did they remove the... Palic Empire. Like what? What was the reasoning behind that? Okay, so a little of native battle. I can't actually tell if those troops are modded or not. To be honest. I think this is going to be a pain in the ass. 80 pierce damage. Jesus. I imagine that since the... Two Wait. Can all the arms kill two two uh, two uh, two enemies like you know cleave through two enemies, or is it just the two-handed weapons like axes and swords? 
Imagine that, like them coming up at, uh, with Paul, I'm just smashing through your infantry, like killing three at a time, they're two at a time. Ooh, a level up. What the fuck leveled up? Who knows? Nope. Alright, I need to switch weapons. I did like open up their uh, Patreon and they already got some models for the Carthaginian faction. So I'm gonna assume that's gonna come in pretty soon. Because, you know, you just need to actually like make the. You know, just make the models and all they need to. Well, they didn't make. Like, I uh, didn't pay for the Patreon yet. I might actually to see what's up. But then I'm, I'm gonna be like, shit, I can't talk about it. <laughs> but I wanna. Why I wanna talk about it? Okay, entrance is on the left. Ew, the lag. Okay, I might need the UI for this. Archers! Archers! Forward! Forward! Move! Take over command! Foot okay, there's no way I'm gonna set them up like I want to, so... No point in that. Hey, you're not supposed to stand on buildings, man. I think I did track uh, better combat, but I just never installed it for some reason. Probably because I was thinking like, it's gonna break the game. So I'm just, surely it's gonna break the game. Oh, look at this, they didn't even get like a chance to get into position. How exactly are we supposed to get these guys? Okay, I need to get the archers to move in on the, on the other side so we can actually kill those campers. Move, man. But I do seriously wish someone actually brought back the thing where you can actually like change the category of the troops. So you can actually leave the Optios and the ones that increase your party capacity somewhere else. Because, you know. You go into a battle, you have a ton of party capacity, a lot of them die, then you lose a ton of party capacity. Reaching out inside something? Oh yeah, I had that. I think I uploaded it short of that. You can look it up on the channel. Anyway, he, one guy was stuck on like a wall or something. And I had to like quit and, you know, send in the troops again. So the bad fighting is still kind of shit. I don't even want to know what the problem here is. 
Look at how many archers I got here. Come on, kill them. Come on. There you go. Oh my god, they killed fuck all, apparently. Yeah, there's still 86 defenders. Look at that. Can, can it... No, no, I want to go the other way. The other way. up because you can get a lot of companions like pretty quick in the mod with the mod my every like hit maybe not stab him I guess the kill count resets, but like, what's the issue there for you? I mean, oh my god. Hey, what the, f the fuck's this? Okay, that's. That's definitely not how it's supposed to look. But we can't complain, it's early access, right? <laughs> oh my god, come on. have some people stuck somewhere oh no come on hey, oh maybe not like why did they make uh, have to make like the retreat point all the way back I mean would be freaking cool if the AI actually like made a defense up here you know or up here you know <laughs> Man, you know the looters are the best infantry in the game. They literally fight for the fight for the lives and steal people's shit. I mean, uh, the thing I want to see, I guess, from Bannerlord is like, since they made all these castles and everything, I want to see the enemy like actually make a defense up here because. Or actually, you know, get the enemy to attack you when you're up here, you know? So you can actually, like, sit here. And then, um, you know, choke, choke hold them on this staircase here. Plop some archers there and there. Or even choke hold them here, actually. Just have a ton of archers on the walls. That's what I want to see. But then again, the AI didn't didn't do that in Total War Medieval 2, so, you know. 
Can't expect too much, right? Hopefully, hopefully in a decade or two. <laughs> this, yeah, this, this side battle is like... Zombie I mean, it was better, uh, better in Warband, I'd say. Maybe in a decade or two, we can actually get the AI with mods and all that good enough so it actually, like, you know, stays up there and defends, you know? It is but a dream, but maybe it will happen at some point. We can only help. <laughs> oh, this may be a problem. Since I told my guys to not leave a garrison anywhere, um, garrison here is gonna be one guy. <laughs> uh, that may be an issue. Issue. Ooh, we can double the amount we're gonna bet. Mm, I think the disguise mission should be better. Mm, well, yeah, I don't, I don't know why they actually like, you know, why they are, you know, like stuck with the modding tools and all that. Let's just give all the modding tools to the people. I mean, there's so many modders out there that are actually making like studios gaming studios like uh, uh, the civil war gettysburg and uh, what was it? Wait, what? i can't remember you know the uh, the radio the good was it dark mod or the radius team i think it's dark mod who made the ultimate yeah ultimate general series they're so good in my opinion at least Granted, I did only play Civil War. I didn't play the Getty, Gettysburg one or the new one. And you didn't look at the models that made uh, like completely different games for Skyrim and Oblivion. And even uh, Fallout as well. And of course, then you look at Prophecy on Pandor. I mean, you know. Who plays Vanilla Warband anymore? I guess the console peasants. Hey, you. You. Hey, hey. Here, man. Hey, you. Come here. Come here. Play some troops in the garrison. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Yes. There you go. Let's take this. No, wait. Hmm. Why is that? Why is that tagged? I have no clue, but let's go take it. Oh, yes. Big battle, boys. Hey, you. How about you go deal with the enemy? No? Okay. Problem is now they're just gonna you know go defend this probably. It's gonna switch switch back around. 
Oh, they're running away. Oh my god, they're actually gonna make it. No, no. Oh, fuck's sakes. Catch the bastards. There we go. Wait here for a sec. Sammy can make it back and hopefully he did. This is one, gonna be a fun one. Let's see, can we upgrade anything? Okay, this, that's correct. Oh, I can't. What? When is that a thing? No, oh, right, you can't. Mm. Forgot about that. We have a big battle, Sammy. We caught up to some barbarians who wanted to... Can't what? Okay, I can click for a second there. Wanted to capture our city. Can you tell me this? Why do we spawn so close to the enemy? Like, you know, it used to be like if, if you, you know, I mean, a thousand at the, you know the higher you know higher amount of troops you have the like further away you spawn. Are they gonna c cross the bridge? Are they gonna cross the Rubicon? Primaris, no. Oh, that's a kill. I like how that increased my throwing by one and my riding by seven. Like what? Infantry! Forward! Archer! Forward! Move! Loose for me! Move! Cavalry! Move! Scape formation! Cavalry! Move! Infantry! Archers! Forward! Well, that's a nice spot. They got their... I can't... I can't risk it. I can't risk... Getting lanced this time. There's too much at stake. Go! I was hoping they're gonna leave their archers on this side of the bridge. Well, this works too. Yo, yo, hey, who told you? Who told you you can attack my guys? Come on. There we go. But why? What? I do love it when the AI moves in, moves into a shittier position and a shittier position again, like all the time. Okay, you guys move over there. No, 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 don't, don't, don't go back. No, 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 no. I want you to go through the water. Come on. Water is nice. It will refresh you. Remember, remember the game Praetorian, the strategy? I can't, I, I tried. I, did, I couldn't make uh, RTS camera work, actually. It just crashed my game for some reason. Remember the game Praetorian where you, if you like, you know, the old RTS game where if you leave your troops... What the... Is this slip? Wait, what? This literally... Oh my god, there's an invisible wall there. That's new. Um, 
water that you can actually you can't actually cross. That's new. That's new and amazing. I do wish your troops didn't like move. Move forward to attack them. You gain Praetorium where you can like leave your infantry in the in the water, or any troops for that matter in the water. And they will like uh, replenish their stamina. I think it was stamina. The longer they are in there. That was a cool fucking feature. And that game is what? 300 fucking years old at this point? I think they did remaster that game. Might actually go pick it up and play it, of course. On stream. I do remember it being freaking hard, though. Yeah? Even on like normal difficulty or whatever it was. Oh, actually, did the RTS camera get an update? Because I do remember it being outdated or something. I don't think any more of them are spawning in. Nope. battle okay I'm gonna copy that and then save that as well so I can actually check it out at some point uh, like uh, again I'm probably not gonna you know add mods any more mods to this playthrough Since we are only gonna like reconquer the empire, then I'm gonna think of it like a new scenario or whatever. Maybe I could do. Right, I should go skirmish or cab only, right? <laughs> that would be fucking fun. <laughs> I shall become the thing I ha hate the most. A party size increased. What? All right, uh, some of these guys probably leveled up. That makes sense. I grab the horses and grab the food. Large bag of pill? No. Hmm, maybe I should grab myself a uh, two-handed weapon. I can have something, you know. Oh, I know what I should get. I should get the Falks. Yeah, definitely. I do wonder, does the Fox actually like go through shield like shields like it used, like it you know is in it does in real life, right? Since it's curved. Okay, they're besieging that. Look at that fucking dickhead. Yeah, I don't actually want. I don't want these two. Let's go. Can we make another part? No, we cannot. Let's go help these guys out because I have no freaking clue why is that tagged on the map. I want to find out. Look at that. 
We have 800 troops from our, our like party guys alone. What the fuck is that? 